Hi, it's Air here. I'm gonna give you a little quick tour of Kendall, Clover Kendall. So we've been open for a couple months here. This is our space um, going down there. I hope you can hear me through the wind. I tried to do this tour a little earlier today, but we were a little too crowded. I couldn't get very good footage, so trying again. And so this is where you come in. Um, this is where the line queues up, so this blue band sort of lets you know um, where you should be waiting. We've got three order takers down here right now, so that's Antoria right here, and um, and she's she's taking an order. We have a custom uh, order system we built ourselves, so she's entering the order in there, and then what happens is it gets distributed. It goes back behind the counter. Now Antoria is doing this face to face, um, so she'll get to ask their name, ask them if they've ever been here before, suggest something, give a sample. Uh, a lot of interaction that wouldn't happen if we just had people at registers. Up here we have the menu. Um, this is an active live menu, so items as they run out get crossed out. I think there's one up there crossed out right now. New items will be added in throughout the day. Over here we're doing this, um, this is a new thing we just started doing a month or two ago. And it's also active, but it's just different things that are going on today. Um, different things we're working on. Um, uh, food items or other exciting things happening within the company. And over here, we have the kitchen. So if you step back, this is the restaurant. Um, I'll show you the back of house later. Uh, but this is our kitchen defined by this stainless counter here and then the wood counter going down that way. And you can see this is our um, drink area. So we've got coffee being poured right here. Uh, that's an iced coffee. Sorry about the glare. That's an iced coffee being made up right now. Those are waiting for some hot coffee. Up here we've got some cold drinks, there's carrot lemonade, um, hibiscus iced tea, and an Assam iced tea. These are all made in-house. Uh, we've got these special grinders, which are awesome, but I don't have time to tell you about right now. Self-serve water taps for customers. We've got soda water, cold water, um, room temp water, some cups you can serve yourself. On the back side we've got beer taps and uh, soda that we make with these syrups right here. Um, so those are all made in-house, we make uh, soda. So that's our drink program. Uh, we've got different soups back there. If you were here at breakfast time, you'd see them chopping up the onions and everything and making those soups. Manlio's uh, putting one together right now. See our oven. Um, we've got some fryers right there. And then um, we have a sink and some other working surfaces. And that's, that's our whole hot line. So these induction burners, the oven, and the fryer. Um, and the, let's see, oh, Manlio's about to put this out. Right here, we've got uh, two back-to-back -back sandwich stations. That's where we work the sandwiches in parallel. So there's a soup going out to a customer right now. Over here is where people wait for their food. And um, we'll come on through here. Um, so this is the, these are the two sandwich lines. We make different sandwiches on each line. There's a chickpea fritter going out in this popular sandwich. And you can see there's um, these little iPods at each station that tell them what to make. So let's take all the items from the order taking up there and they distribute it through the kitchen. We can process um, comfortably four, uh, four to five customers a minute for sustained periods, which is a lot. Uh, the best I've ever clocked at Chipotle is like 1.8, 1.6. Um, this is where we cut potatoes. And then over here we have, that's what we have instead of a walk-in. So it's just a reach-in refrigerator. We turn that about three, four times a day. Um, this is the prep tables here and here. We're in the tail end of the lunch rush, so they're not doing any prep right now. But a little later this afternoon, they'll be using these tables. Earlier this morning, they were using them to make food. Uh, we've got a living wall up there. And this is a larger community table right here uh, with the live edge, something we started doing at the trucks a long time ago. We've got counter seating um, all along here. A little bit of seating back here. It's a little quieter nook. Um, we use these active walls again. This one lets us talk about um, uh, some other like things going on with food and other exciting things. We use uh, images and video up here. It's introducing an employee, for example. And that one we're using for the website right now. We could use it for other things. This is our closest thing to back of house. I guess I don't have a key right now, but it's just it's our mop closet. Um, a big difference between our restaurant and what you'll find in other fast casual restaurants is we essentially have zero back of house and we have a couple closets and that's it. Uh, and that allows customers to see everything we're doing, even our dishes. So here's our four bay sink right there. Um, it's, all, uh, it's all part of what we do. It's all transparent and in the open. Uh, we've got a couple bathrooms back here. Um, let's grab one of them. 
Um, so it's just a, uh, uh, a pretty, pretty streamlined, simple treatment. We want the bathroom to feel really clean. Uh, and that is the tour. That's the tour of our uh, of our latest clover. Um, we're working on some outdoor seating for the spring. She's going to be out there in a month or two, which we're really excited about. And uh, that's Clover Kendall. Thanks.